guys, it's Lynn again with Little Foot Nursery. Um, I am um, here with a box opening and I uh, wanted to share with you guys a new Life of Faith doll that I brought from eBay. So this is a used doll. Um, I have not see opened, taken her out of the box yet. So let's go ahead and take her out. This is actually the Millie doll. So, all right. Okay, so she's got some accessories here. She's got her dog. Okay, everything looks pretty used. Um, this is her dog. She's got a little purse, a hairbrush, and her hat. So, okay. So tough, you guys. I'm like not great about used things <laughs> sometimes. Oh, cool. This is pretty cool. This is a doll stand. And it, it holds like a um, Okay, let me go ahead and open this. Okay, cool. It holds like this dress form. That's pretty cool. That's kind of cool. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pop that on there. This I never own. Um, okay. All right, then we have some clothes. And then let's go ahead and get the doll out. They wrapped her really well. Okay. Okay, cool. So... And I'm still waiting for one more doll lately, but I also had a little bit of a surprise because I actually have a second Millie as well, which I will show you guys. So thank you for bearing with me while I take a little bit of a break from <laughs> filming my reborns. Hold on, let me just make sure you guys can see. Oh yeah, it's a little bit. Let me go ahead and zoom in a tiny bit. Okay. on the hunt for a brand new inbox Millie, but I decided to go ahead and get this one while I could. And I, she came, she comes with some really nice outfits too. So I kind of wanted the outfits as well. <laughs> Felt it was worth it from, from that perspective. Okay. So let me She's in good condition. Aww. Oh, she's really pretty. So she's got, um, I guess she's got her, she's got her two braids. I don't know that if these were the original braids. I don't know if she, if they ever took them out. I get, I'm guessing they probably did, but they braided, they braided it up pretty nicely. And here she is, and she's wearing her dress. Um, and this dress, by the way, belong actually belongs to Kathleen. This is a Kathleen dress, <laughs> and that's Kathleen's nightgown. So that's definitely like interesting that they mixed and matched. Okay, hold on. Let me let me zoom back out because I think it's a little bit hard to see. I don't know if you guys can see her, but um, yeah, she's really pretty. Trying to, trying to check out the, she's wearing these like interesting stockings, which I don't think these match this dress. I could be wrong though. Um, cool. I'm glad she comes with a hairbrush. I can brush her hair. So that's pretty cool. So let's go ahead and brush it out a little bit. Um, yeah, so. I'm just waiting for Laylee and I'll have all of them. 
but yeah, but I do still kind of want a brand new inbox violet. I don't, not violet, um, Millie, if I can find one, but it's okay. This is a really pretty one. Now, one thing I did hear and, you know, just read about in some of the different message boards, there's actually a Facebook group for Life of Faith. It's a, it's a pretty small little community because these dolls, you know, it's hard when the company isn't around anymore and they're not producing new dolls. Okay, her, her hair looks really pretty. Um, yeah, she looks like she's pretty well taken care of, so... Yeah, not perfect, but, you know, really, still really nice. Um, okay, cool. So, well, they were saying that, so if you'll notice this Millie, her eyes are actually violet, violet in color. She's, they're, they're kind of blue-violet, sort of this light. They're really pretty. Okay, and then let's check out what comes in this bag. And it's interesting because... Um, you know, these, these items were, um, like this, this nightgown, actually, I mean, yeah, it belongs to Kathleen, actually, <laughs> these are Kathleen's outfits, <laughs> so it has this, um, I think they call it a feed sack nightgown, because Kathleen grew up in the Great Depression, and they had to, like, make, um, you know, they had to get creative to make clothes, I think, so they call this a feed, so I think this was probably made out of a feed sack in the story, Okay, so a bunch of ribbons, and and this is a blanket. I suspect this blanket might belong to Kathleen as well, but I'm not like 100% sure on that. So, okay, and then let's check out the other, oops, oh my goodness, sorry you guys. <laughs> oh, okay, so, so sorry. Okay, let's check out the other things. So this is um, Millie's dog, and this dog looks pretty well loved. <laughs> Um, everything else actually seems in better condition. The dog is kind of the most loved, but okay. And then she has this bonnet. Check this out. Okay. So let's, let's try this on her. Oh my goodness. Okay. That's really pretty here. Let's, let me lower this so you guys can see her. Oops. It's a little hard to see because of the light. She keeps wanting to fall over. So sorry about that. Let me. Let me fix that. <laughs> but yeah, so this is a, so I just got this one from eBay and I actually bought another, um, oh, I'm kind of afraid to look in here. Oh, okay. She's got little things in here. She's got socks, her little Bible. Funny, she's got two, there's two little Bibles. So I think this must have been, she must have had a Kathleen doll at one point and maybe sold it, but she's got like just ran some random things in here. So a little, a little random. Um, yeah, I'm not really, I have a hard time with used things sometimes. I know it sounds terrible, terribly snobbish, but let me go ahead and put some of these things which I don't think, don't really see myself using as much, like the blanket, this, the ribbons and the dog. I just kind of tuck those away because, I don't know. <laughs> um, have a little bit of a tough time. Okay. I'm just such a germaphobe, you guys. And especially now with the whole COVID situation, it's like worse. <laughs> so, um, anyway, I'm, I'm going to need to like, let this doll like air out or something. She just, you know, she just, she's, she came from a smoke free home, but yeah, you know, she's kind of, just to kind of air her out, but yeah, but I love her hair. Her hair is so beautiful. Anyway, she's a really, really pretty Millie doll. Really, really pretty. So, so that's Millie. Okay, so guys, I need to introduce you guys to another doll that I just recently bought. I'm oh, sorry. This is a... Uh, okay. Okay, let me introduce you guys to... Um, so this is also a Millie doll, but she has a makeover. They made her over to be a modern doll. Isn't she gorgeous? So I'm going to put her right here so we can compare them. And it's interesting because this Millie seems to be shorter now that I'm, I have them like side by side. Um, I don't know if it's like the shoes that they're wearing, but here, let me, sorry, let me move her head over just a tiny tad so you can see and let's compare them. 
yeah, this Millie here on the right definitely seems shorter. But, um, and what's also interesting is her eyes are different. If you look at her eyes, I think they replaced her eyes because the original Millie didn't come with these eyes. They, um, so they totally made her over, but she, she feels like a, a pretty brand new doll. Like her eyelashes are super thick. So, um, she, I think she's gorgeous. Okay. And then this is the, um, the Millie, the Life of Faith Millie, which I think is, this is her original wig, I believe. And her original eyes but you know she's in good condition it's just um it's just so interesting that they look so this is kind of like the old-fashioned Millie and the modern Millie and this Millie is so cute she also came um she came with a hat like a little beret you know which um she would kind of just wear on her head like so and then she also has this really cute little Dalmatian puppy that she came with so that's pretty cute too. So it's funny how, yeah, I mean, it's really this, this seller on eBay, um, they've made over a bunch of other dolls, but I just really love the attention to detail. Um, just everything coordinates like this headband, you know, her beautiful face. Okay. And she has this wig. It just kind of, she has like more strawberry blonde hair. You can see like, you can compare the hair colors. This Millie's hair is like more ashy blonde and this one's more of a reddish blonde but um I think she's adorable and so when I saw her even though she wasn't like historically accurate because they made her as a modern uh, modern girl I think she, I think this outfit is adorable and I think she's adorable so yeah check out this outfit how cute this is <laughs> so um so I'm kind of debating whether I should change one of them into I think I will maybe change the old-fashioned Millie into the Millie dress that I just recently bought and um, and try that. This this doll's just so cute as a modern girl. I kind of want to keep her that way it's for now. So, um, okay, so let's go ahead and change Millie into the other dress um, that I got. So give me one second. I'm going to go ahead and just grab it. Okay. Um, And guys, I have not gotten my test results yet. I mean, by the time you guys read this, I'm hoping I'll have it by then, but it's been over a week now and I was supposed to hear in five days, so I don't really know what happened, but anyway, I will make a, once I hear, I will make a post, I will post it on that original video where I talked about going to get tested. So, okay. So this was, this is actually Millie's dress. Um, the dress she's wearing is Kathleen. So let's go ahead and change her out of it because this is not the correct <laughs> outfit for her to be wearing. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pop this off. And I kind of feel like the socks she wears actually goes with this dress. So we'll, we'll let her keep her pantalette and all of that stuff because she needs that. Those are her under things. Um, oh, interesting. So the, so somehow, oh yeah, the dress had gotten a little bit unbuttoned, but I don't think that's a huge deal. Um, I mean, this doll basically, I think she was, I think she was well loved by her prior owner, but she was also, I think, pretty well taken care of. She seems fairly clean and all that. I, I might give her a little bit of a wipe down. I don't know. Um, I think technically she could be bathed um, since she's, she actually is all vinyl. The bodies are all vinyl. Oh yeah, and that, that's one other thing. That the hands come together, they can come together like, like they're praying. <laughs> so, some people like that, some people don't. But, I mean, it's actually a, a pretty normal or um, natural position for the hands to be in. So, okay, I'm going to go ahead. This just has a bit of a smell. So, I don't know. I might just try to wash it. That might be a good call. Okay. Okay, but let's go ahead and get her changed so you guys can see. Okay, so. Let's dress her up in this.
top. What I might do is do dry L. It just needs a little freshening up, right? It's not like the thing the dress has stains or anything like that, but just just to get just freshen it up from a smell perspective. So oh, she's so pretty in this. Oh, this is adorable. Oh, so pretty. Okay, guys, here. Let me let me stand her up and show her to you. And again, apologies, yeah, the <laughs> She doesn't stand up the best. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so pretty. And and the bows and actually bows and everything actually match really well. So this is like a dress form if you wanted to display a dress, but yeah, she's wearing her dress now. So that just looks much more suitable for her. This is like her party dress. Oh, she's so cute. I like the modern Millie too. I'm gonna have to come up with like a different name for her. Um let me know if you guys have a good name for the modern Millie, because I don't want to call her Millie because she's just, she kind of looks different. She just looks different. She has a very different like look to her. Um, I'm going to put her on this side because, but yeah, I, I just think um, they're both like just so adorable. <laughs> so um, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching and um, thank you for, uh, you know, just, kind of letting me have a little bit of a break from filming the the babies. Um, but I'm just like really excited about reacquiring th these Life of Faith dolls. Um, Cause I collected, I used to have all of them and I had a bunch of their clothes, but now I only have um, really, I, the only one I saved was Violet and her trunk um, and all her outfits and, and, and everything. So I'm, it's, it's great to get the other ones back. <laughs> all right, guys. And I'll have to do a video sometime with all of them together, but thank you so much for watching. Hope you'll um, like this video and subscribe and I will talk to you all later. Bye.